Alright, hello everyone out there in YouTube land. This is Mike once again. Uh, it's been quite a few months since I've done a post. A lot of stuff has happened to me since then. Uh, we sold our house in 48 hours, so we had to find a place to uh, live. Um, we're living in an apartment right now until our house is being built, or is uh, finished being built. I um, also had to make some choices as far as comics. Um, you know, our new house payment is going to be twice as much as what our current, as our previous one was, so I had to really cut down on the comics. Um, I'm pretty much going to give up Bynes, uh modern comics. Uh, the comics that come out weekly unless it's something I really, really want. I am going to keep getting uh, Manifest Destiny, which I really love. Um, but other than that, I'm going to try and focus on a lot of the older ones and keys and um, first appearances and things like that and try and complete some of the runs um, that I'm showing here that um, I really want to complete. Um, but I have done um, some shopping. There was a 25 cent sale. I'd mentioned that in my last video, and there was another one since then that I went to, and I picked up uh, some great stuff. I got some really good steals, and I'll I'll show you guys and I'll um, talk about it uh, when I bring them up. I'm gonna try and fit this all in one video, but we'll see how it goes. Here's the first one. Now this one I didn't get for 25 cents. Um, this one actually, one of the local shops I go to. They had a huge sale, and this was actually out of their dollar box. So I got this one for 25 cents. Um, it's in great, great, or sorry, dollar, not 25 cents. I was looking at the sticker. Uh, this is Commandy Last Boy, number 28. I want to try and finish that run. Um, here's A Team, number two. This was one of the dollar ones. Um, nothing significant about it, except for, you know, I was a kid of the 80s and um, I grew up watching the show and I thought it would be neat just to have something there's you know Brackus Mr. T fighting a sumo wrestler I got West Coast Avengers number one that was a dollar as well don't know anything about this um, this is the human fly number one um, other than Knowing that it was a, you know, it's a number one. I don't know anything about the human fly or anything like that. So any information you guys can give me, I'll try and look it up and read it and stuff. Um, so, but it looks pretty cool. I love that cover. Here's Iron Man number 182. Uh, Tony's dealing with alcohol again. Um, not a big Iron Man fan, but I really like the cover. And so that's one of the reasons I bought it. Here is Marvel Premiere featuring Torpedo, number 39. That one was a dollar. This one was from a different comic shop uh, up by my in-laws that I went and got. Here's Iron Man, number 189. Um, not quite sure anything about it. A, a lot of these, I mean, if, if it's a key that I know, I'll, I'll say who the, the first appearance and stuff like that is. But unfortunately, because I have so many to the show, I didn't um, really prepare and write them down and stuff like that. So uh, bear with me if I say something incorrect or something like that. Here is Iron Man number 189. Again, like in the covers and stuff like that. So um, got that. Here is an, um, at my comic shop where they had the, the sale in the dollar box. Um, I bought this Fantastic Four. Um, it, um, it's uh, number two of five, I believe. Uh, Yanni had told me it was the f um, it's the first appearance of uh, Nova Corps. I believe I believe if I'm wrong, correct me. But I thought he said that was this, and I did pick one, show one up in my last video. Um, and I went back a couple months later, and he still had this in the dollar box. So I went ahead and picked it up just for the heck of it. Here's Deadpool number thirty-four. He's one of my favorite guys, so I go ahead and pick him up. Um, these are a couple of the, the ones that I've picked up that were moderns. Manifest Destiny number 10. Copperhead, haven't read that one all the way yet. Manifest Destiny, I believe this is 11. I think that's what this one is. Number, Yeah, number 11. All right.
And again, to go along with my Deadpool, there's the first uh, Deadpool Art of War number one. Let's see. Got Rocket Raccoon number four. And uh, these next three. Next four are, um, if you've seen my previous videos, you know I'm trying to complete the 300 run of Superman. Um, so these are ones that I was able to find at um, some of the stores. This is uh, 341. Three fifty five, three seventy two, and three eighty seven. So I'm getting close. I've probably got about twenty. We're well, not getting close. I've probably got about twenty out of the hundred that I want. Marvel Tales featuring Spider-Man number 89. Um, and I've got Bob's Burger number 2. Number 3. I've also got the new rendition of Dark Horse Presents. Um, slim down version, cheaper cost. Got this one for a dollar. This uh, one here... Um, Deadpool cable number 45. Got that for a dollar off um, the retail price. Um, now, some of these ones that I'm going to be showing here were um, one of the comics that I, stores I go to. He has a where he sends, um, he basically packages 50 at a time and sells them for six or seven dollars. Um, so, a lot of these are going to be, uh, I think I broke it down, I think it was like 14 cents. Um, Savage Wolverine number 11. Combat number one, number one. Never heard of it. The Monarchy number seven. Freak Force number seven. Command Decision Shock Rocks number two. Micronauts number 55. X Force number 8. Shazam the New Beginning, a four part uh, mini series, uh, number 4. And again, Shazam number uh, New Beginnings, number 2. It's nice with uh, Black Adam on there, it's a pretty sweet cover. Those again were all uh, 14 cents. So, really like this cover here as well. Uh, Captain Adam number nine. Millennium number one. Legion 91 number 24. Man of Steel number two. And trying to complete my, uh, with this one, trying to complete my Justice League Europe and International. This is number 25. The Phantom Zone. This is number one. I didn't, when I picked this up, I didn't know anything about it. But then I went ahead and was putting it into my database. And apparently I have number, I think it's three. I think so. I was like, "All right, well, that's cool." So this one actually here was, I believe, one of the twenty-five cent ones from the sale. Got the Superman, the Ten Cent Adventures, and uh, I've got the Spectre number one of three, uh, Infinite Crisis Aftermath. This was a twenty-five cent one. Villains United, number one, again, 25 cents. Irredeemable, number 12. Irredeemable, number one. And Irredeemable, number 11. 
Those were all, those were 25 cents as well. Oops. Not enough room! I can't wait for this new house. It's going to be twice the size of our old one. I'll have so much room. I'm actually going to have a man cave. I told the wife, I said, I don't care. You get the entire house. I want a man cave. That's all I want. On some of these, um, I don't think I have, but I might have shown them before. If I did, I do apologize. Um, in the move and everything, I did, um, don't know 100% what I um, packed because all my boxes are actually at my parents' house. So these are just all brand new ones that I either brought over or stuff like that. Uh, DC Comics presents uh, Superman and the Global Guardians number 46. This is uh, from Avatar. It's uh, Caliban number 6. Um, I think this one's already finished. I think it was a total of 7. 7 or 8, I can't remember. Maybe even 9. Um, but I was really enjoying it and I'm curious to see how it finishes up. Green Arrow number 39. Deadpool's Dracula's Gauntlet number 5. This next one here, definitely not in the best shape, but I really, I, I love the cover. Um, yeah. Marvel Comics, uh, Greatest Comics, number 78. I, it's a, uh, you know, reprint, uh, I can't remember. I, I, I can't remember which one it is. I, I think it's, it's uh, before 100, the story, but I can't remember exactly what it is. Sergeant Rock number 385. DC Comics present number 45, Superman and Firestorm. Brave and the Bold number 194, Batman and the Flash. DC Comics presents number 12. Superman, Mr. Miracle. Next one I got for a dollar here. Uh, Tarzan, Lord of the Jungle. Mainly picked it up because I really like the artwork. Uh, number 18. Dracula's Gauntlet, number 6. Amazing Spider-Man, number 5. Deadpool, number 33. Armor Hunters number two. Infinity Crisis number two. And Infinity Crisis number three. You guys are probably asking where's the good stuff. Well, I'm, as I go through here, I'm holding them off because I want to tell because I'm, I thought I, I, I thought I did fantastic. So hopefully you guys enjoy what I'm showing you. Walking Dead number 129. And these were I, I picked up at the sale because I think he had a buy three get one free or something like that on back issues. And this was a uh, number one twenty eight. Turok number six. Deadpool number thirty two. Injustice year two number eight. Unity number nine. Armor Hunters number two. Star Wars 19. I just saw uh, the other day um, the new Star Wars that they're coming out with Marvel in January. Um, the cover. If you guys haven't seen it, take a look for the Alex Ross. I believe it's a 1 in 50. Oh my god, is that awesome. I want that so bad. I don't know how I'm going to uh, get it, but we shall see. Almost positive I've shown these. I want to show these again. Alright. We got New Teen Titans number one. I believe this is the. I think this is the third volume. Fantastic Four annual number 23. Daredevil, The Man Without Fear, number 295. I don't know about you guys, but I can't stand Ghost Rider. I don't, I, I just, 
something about him. I just think he's probably one of the lamest, lamest characters out there. But that's just me. I've never liked him. I remember back in the 90s when I was getting comics, and I'm just like, oh, God, I hate Dare, you know, Ghost Rider. But that's just me. I mean, you know. So tell me what you think. Heavy Hitters Feud by uh, Epic Number One. Pretty interesting. So. Suicide Squad Number Nine. Walking Dead Number One Thirty. I actually got this one for fourteen cents. Um, now a lot of these ones I'm going to be showing. These are the twenty-five cent ones that I bought and stuff. Um, I'm trying to as much as I can. Complete my run of the new mutants. Of course, uh, Cable and Deadpool are going to be a little bit of a challenge. I do have Cable's uh, second, <clears throat> a second print, um, but I don't have the first print, so we'll see how that goes. Got New Mutants number sixty-one, number seventy, number sixty-six. Sorry if these aren't any in, in in order. I was just I had to bag all of them earlier today. Seventy nine, fifty six, thirty, fifty nine, fifty seven. Um. In here, I think somewhere there might be a uh, one or two duplicates. Yeah, right here, sixty-one. Because um, a couple of them came in the fourteen-cent packs and stuff. So, um, number forty-three, number three. Really like that cover. Twenty-four, fifty-six. 62 40 41 I really like this one uh, Mirage vs. Death that's a, that's a pretty sweet cover 39 The New Hellions <laughs> and this is probably this next one here is probably one of my favorite New Mutant covers uh, number six. And then number 49. All right, and I think that's it for all the new mutants I have. I might have some more. I'm not sure. Um, here's New Teens. The New Teen Titans Annual number two. New Teen Titans number three. Now this comic right here... You know, I picked up and I saw, you know, it's, I think it's, I think Atlas is the, yeah, Atlas is the publisher of the Scorpion. You know, I was like, oh, I'd seen it there once before and I didn't pick it up and I didn't think anything about it. And then I was like, I saw it this time, I'm like, ah, oh, what the heck, it looks kind of cool. So I go ahead and pick it up and I mean, you know, it, it's not, you know, it's, you can see there's some color bleed or wear and tear and stuff. But, but I mean, other than that, I mean, the corners are kind of sharp and the, the, uh, Staples are kind of eh, but um, so you know I'm looking this one up and stuff, and I see that this one like you know in a really good shape is going you know for twenty thirty dollars, and I was like what? And uh, in this shape, you know I paid twenty five cents for it. In this shape, it's probably I don't know a six six dollar book or so. Um, but you know this was a uh, number one, so I was like all right, well that's, that's hey can't complain about that. Um, the Infinity Infinity. Crusade number one. Uh, this next one here I just picked because I was a fan of the, the movie growing up and uh, I just thought it was kind of neat. Uh, the Willow number one. So, got Gambit's uh, number one. Let's see here. This one I had no idea that Virgin made comics. Um, it's called Dan Dare. I guess this is the variant edition. I don't know anything about it. Issue number two here. Batman Shadow of the Bout. Shadow of the Bat. It's the one millionth issue. I didn't know it had been around that long. 
Did you guys? <laughs> Aquaman special number one. I actually have like two or three of these that I got as a kid and stuff. Um, you know, they're 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 about a three or four dollar book. Um, you know, this was one of the fourteen cent ones here. I didn't. I was like, you know, unless it's like original Aquaman, I think he's pretty lame. So I didn't want anything to do with him. So. Wolverine annual number one. And then here was uh, Mark Spector, Moon Knight, number 36. Savage Dragon, number one. I might use that for uh, firewood if I need to. So. Captain America, number 403. Alright, dog's getting down here, getting out of the way. Go on, get, go, go. Darkhawk Annual Number One, Silver Surfer Seventy Two. All right. Uh, why? Why is this sticking? All right. Give it a little tease here, a little, little bit of goodness here. Um, I already have one of these, but now when I've got these, this will make four. I have uh, this one. I got four. 25 cents, X Force number two, Deadpool second appearance. That one's 25 cents. And this one was in the pack of 50 for seven dollars, so that was 14 cents. Um, yeah, they're, they're in uh, pretty good shape. And uh, Deadpool second appearance, I really, uh, you know, like that. If I can't get the first one, at least I can get the second appearance, and hopefully someday I'll be able to afford the first appearance. But can't complain about that. <coughs> we got Hell's Angel number one. New Mutants number 60. The New Mutants annual number one. I know I can't. I know there's two people that make their first appearance in here, but I can't for the life of me. I think one of them's name is Lily something. I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, and then, you know, this next one, I was, uh, you know, just looking through the 25 cent box and I saw all of them. I thought it was kind of cool with um, him uh, taking over as uh, Captain America. So I was like, all right. Um, I was able to find the Falcon his four-part mini-series um, and all those cost me a dollar I mean you know each one was 25 cents so and it was funny because I went into a comic shop last night uh, one of my guys and he had all of them bagged and he, he didn't have a, a price on them but he had them all together and I was like huh I got all these for a dollar this past weekend so pretty cool I got Power Man and Iron Fist number 61 Here. I got War of the Gods number four. I got a couple more of those. Okay. Here's War of the Gods one. And War of the Gods number three. Was not able to find number two, but it's alright. I'll find it eventually. I got Fool Killer number five. And Fool Killer number eight. You know, those are becoming somewhat hot because of uh, comic book guys were talking about them and the stuff like that. So it's not why I bought them, but you know, I, I know it'll be kind of a dip challenge going forward to find to find some of them just because of that. Um, and then here's another run I'm trying to complete all of them. I don't know how far I'll get. Um, Tale of the Teen Titans number fifty one. 52 38 35 39 that makes the second one of that that I have 
36, 32, and th um, this is New Warriors number 27. I ran out of bags and boards, so I didn't get a chance to bag and board them all. Um, so I don't know how much of this stuff is actually worth showing you guys. Let me see here. Maybe some of it is. I don't know. You guys be the judge. Got Captain Marvel 12. Marvel Comics presents Lame Rider and Iron Fist. This uh, Red Sonia number eight. I've got most of the other ones, so I wanted to pick this one up. That was twenty-five cents. And if you guys remember the show, if you guys are old enough from the eighties, um, where lizards like to snack on humans. Um, so I was able to get V number four, number five, fourteen and 15 so I'm gonna try and go ahead and complete that run I remember you know I liked the miniseries when I was a kid and then a couple years ago when they brought it back out again I liked it I was kinda sad that it didn't didn't last very long Fantastic Four number 17 Solo Adventures number 13 Marvel Knights Spider-Man 6 Eight and nine. Stupid, 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 stupid. Lame, lame. Let me look here. We got X Men and the Micronauts number one. Elongated Man number one. Micronauts the New Voyage number one. Hmm. Alpha Flight number 63. Let's see. You know, the problem with, you know, getting some of that the six, six pack one is you get a lot of, the six dollar one for 50, you get a lot of junk or, you know, stuff. So I don't want to waste you guys' time with some of it. Uh, here's the X-Men and Micronauts number two. The Milkman Murders number four. No one cares about Ravage, Fantastic Fours. thought this one was neat. I hadn't, I haven't read it yet. Return of the Megaton. Let's see. Here is X Men and Alpha Flight number one. Marvel two and ones. I really like these. The Thing and Iron Man number ninety-seven. X Force number fifteen. Guardians of the Galaxy Annual number one and Alpha Flight number fifty. All right, that's pretty much it for the comics, except for one more I want to show you guys here. Um, so this box that I went through had been picked through a couple times by guys that had been there, um, you know, before I moved it over to that box, and I didn't think anything, you know, special. So I go ahead and I. Uh, flip through it and about the fourth book in I find this I'm sure all of you know what this is Alpha Flight number 17 guest starring Big Hero 6 first appearance of Big Hero 6 some say some don't say um, but uh, I saw this and I was like is this what I think it is so I had to look it up when I was standing there because I couldn't remember I thought it was pretty sure it was but I wanted to make sure so I looked it up and uh, sure enough, it you know it, it was, and um, 
I about uh, crapped my pants there. I was like, oh my God, you know, this is crazy. I, I can't believe I have this in my hands, you know. Um, <clears throat> I was like, all right, put it in my stack. And I'm like, well, just continue to see what else you can find and stuff. But I couldn't, I was just, my mind was racing. I couldn't believe it. I was, you know, going crazy. Um, so I couldn't concentrate. So I'm like, all right, fine. Just go ahead and pick up two of these 50 packs. Um, and we, let's just go ahead and walk out the door. Um, so I go up to pay for everything. And I'm like, you know, this guy is... He's going to see it. He's going to take it. There's no way I'm going to get it. You know, so I come back and he says, okay, you know, he's, I go to look at their uh, sets they have and stuff and I didn't see anything. Come back and he says, all right, you know, it's 30 some dollars or whatever for everything. And so I get, get it. I'm like, all right. So I go out to the car and I look for it and I was like, oh my God, I got this for 25 cents. Alpha Flight number six, 17, guest starring Big Hero 6. Um, so I was pretty happy about this, um, you know, I was, I was really happy, I mean, it definitely made, uh, the 20, everything else, you know, a lot of the, the junk that I got, um, you know, a lot of stuff I didn't show you and stuff, this was so worth it, <clears throat> and then along with the, um, what was it, the, oh heck, what was it, the X-Factors number two and stuff like that, um, so overall I had a great, um, great time. Uh, at the, at the uh, 25 cent sale and I'll definitely be going back again in three months when they have it again um, and I'm going to keep uh, getting some of the, the older comics trying to you know pass on the, the newer ones for right now I want to pick up a lot of the, the old stuff like I had said so um, if you like what you see please go ahead and subscribe and uh, hit me up and I'll also subscribe you back and let all your friends know that I'm back and uh, looking to um, add subscribers and um, join other other people as well so have a good day and I will talk to you later